Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today is the day I've been dreading my whole life. I am cleaning out my K-pop album shelf. This shelf has been through hell and back. It is stuffed like a turkey on Thanksgiving, over the top, crowded, nothing fits anymore. I've had to start putting some stuff in bins because it doesn't fit. There's racks, another rack filled with stuff. But today is a day that I'm gonna be cleaning it out. I'm gonna be getting rid of some albums as well. So I'm gonna be listing those on Depop, on my Depop, and I've been selling a few clothes on there. But I am gonna start selling K-pop albums and PCs that I just don't see myself having anymore. My room is a huge mess right now because I'm still in the process of like redecorating everything. So if you occasionally see bags filled with trash or bags filled with clothes, ignore that. I got a box, a cardboard box of all the albums I'm gonna put in there that I don't want anymore. Just a disclaimer, no hate to any of the groups of the albums that I'm gonna sell. I'm just trying to limit my collection. I'm only gonna stick to keeping the albums of groups that I ult. And take this with a grain of salt because I feel like I'm only gonna get rid of like two and then keep the majority because I have like attachment issues. I've been dreading this for so long. Like I don't even want to, I don't want to touch it. I got more shelves because I know this is not going to be enough to hold all of it. Or maybe it is, who knows. But I did order two more shelves that haven't come in the mail yet that I plan on putting albums on there as well. This isn't going to be my only K-pop album shelf where I'm going to put stuff on, but it is going to be like the main one. Okay, so a lot of stuff on here are books. I'm not going to touch my book stuff because that's a whole other process in its own. So I'm just going to put all of that side. All the albums and stuff is what I'm gonna be working on. Oh, snap. this is the best thing ever and I haven't had time or space to put some of these posters up but oh my god it's so good. Over here I have all of my vinyls. I got this cute little rack thing. Okay, I'm just gonna put aside all of the albums that I'm gonna keep and the ones I'm not gonna keep in here and just work my way like that and then go through this as well. And then at the end, I'm gonna make it really cute and like organized, I guess. So most of my NCT stuff, I'm gonna keep like no doubt about it. So perfume, I'm gonna keep. Sha -la -la, I'm gonna keep as well. Now moving forward, I'm only gonna get one copy of each version. For NCT, I'm gonna keep getting every version of every album just because they're my ults and I just like, I love them, you know? But for example, let's say like AT's or P1 Harmony or I've, I'm only gonna get like one version. I'm not gonna be super into like collecting all of the versions because y'all, it's getting too much. It's getting too crowded and there's no more room for that. I like to get duplicates so I can have one album to keep like its full compact thing But I also like to get an extra one so I can like rip off the pages from the album Because there's a lot of really cute pictures on those that I like to put up on my wall as well But I think those are best to just like thrift, you know, not to buy like a new unopened album I think for those like a lot of thrift stores have been starting to like resell just like the albums like without the PCs So I think I'm just gonna start doing that instead which are sold for like really cheap like less than 10 bucks Because I only only really just want it for the pictures not really for like the PC or anything from my room decorating or reorganizing videos I already set apart a box of all of the like pictures and like mini photo cards or like fan photo cards that I plan on selling and most of it is BTS stuff and like an occasional NCT thing I do plan on selling those as well see so far I haven't gotten rid of anything like that is not good guys we are not off to a good start Okay, I cleaned out the things that were here and I literally kept everything. So let's not even talk about it. So now we have this thing. I got this cute magazine rack at a farmer's market and it's the cutest freaking thing for like your magazines and stuff. So I have a lot of magazines on here and just a lot of stuff that I've just kind of tossed in there. I'm gonna keep all of my magazines because most of the magazines I have are mark related. So obviously I'm gonna keep him. Yeah, there's a few BTS magazines. I think this is really cute. I just, I don't keep up with them that much and I feel like another fan is gonna appreciate it more than I will. Yeah, I'm just gonna, I'm gonna, okay. First item, don't think about it. This has BTS and Blackpink stuff and I remember I ripped out the NCT posters. Robert Pattinson, baddie, I'm gonna keep you. These are all magazines so I'm gonna keep those in here and just not even touch it. Okay, now we get to the big bulk. The big bulk. This shelf I got from Ikea. It's the best shelf. A lot of K-pop stands use it or like book lovers use it because it just holds a lot, you know. There's four little cubes and they each 
have their own little aesthetic to them like you could organize it based by color or by literally anything so you can either put it vertically so have it being tall or you could put it horizontally but that takes up much much more space and i don't have the space for that so i'm gonna start putting away all of the little knickknacks this is garbage i also got a trash bag over here there's a lot of random stuff like little s minis that i just like dangle okay i'm gonna start in the middle section so like these i keep every single freebie that i get or any little gift that i receive from you guys at concerts because sometimes some of my viewers will like make me cute little bracelets or keychains and stickers and i keep every little thing like trust guys like necklaces and keychains i like move them to like my jewelry section but all of the stickers and like cup sleeves i need to organize better i keep all of the cup sleeves which are really cute these are p1 harmony and ATs. I got both Mark Daikons because he's in Dream and 127. I literally had to get both. <gasps> someone was making like Mark's child merch because he didn't come out with merch. So someone was making like literally DIY albums, kinos. And so they literally made me, oh my God, so cute. They made it so well, like it looks like so real. It's the freaking cutest thing ever. Like it's too good. Oh, you see, I need to display these things. I need to show off my man. Punch. I'm gonna keep the punch. Okay, this is where it's gonna get crazy because I bought four of these. I did not need to get four. I got like two from Target and then two from Barnes and Noble. I didn't need to do all that. I'm kind of sad, but I think I need to get, or I need to sell a lot of my Twice stuff. I love my girls, but I just don't keep up with them as much. But I am gonna keep a few because I do really like the concepts. Oh, this one is so good. I need to keep this one. I got a CIX album right before I was gonna go see them live because I wanted to like listen to their music and like fully have their things. But they're one of those groups that I all also just don't keep up with these are literally brand new we're doing good guys okay celine dion <laughs> what the freak wait this kind of tripped me up a bit dude celine dion is baddie oh i need to play this cd rm's indigo too good the little post this is literally if you don't want to commit to like the big album of rms his little mini one is too freaking good like something i love about bts is that they go crazy with like their inclusions like especially v and rm they include like pictures i'm gonna redecorate my wall soon after i finish organizing everything and this is definitely something that i'm gonna get from because oh my freaking god don't even get me started i think on v's album he also included postcards which i freaking love like they need to start doing that more my man new accent Axis. This is DPRs. I'm gonna keep that as well. Dio, don't even. I'm gonna keep you crushed. These, I got so many of these, it's not even funny. These are so vintage, bro. Love Holic? I think these I also got too. Oh. I don't want to get rid of all of my BTS stuff because they were one of the first few groups that I got really into. Ow. So, in Hyphen is also one of them. I love this album so much, but I just don't keep up with them. And the reason why I got these albums was because I freaking love one of the songs. Like, I, I was super obsessed with this album and I was like, I need to freaking get it. With me, like, I, I have this, like, bad habit where, like, if I like one song from an album, I'm gonna get the whole album. Like, I'm just gonna do it. I did not need this many. I did not need this many. I don't know if I'm gonna sell them with the PC. I need to get Rise albums. I only have one, I think, from when Fernanda gave me one. The times I've been to Sarang Hello, I haven't seen them. I think because they're always sold out, as they freaking should. Okay, I cleared out one cube, and I think we made some progress. I think I think we're doing good so far. Now I'm gonna move on to this cube over here. This little bad boy over here. Everything is literally collecting dust. Tell me you like Mark. Well, telling me you like Mark. I collect a lot of my favorite movies on DVD. So I need to find a good place for me to store these, but that's gonna be separate. This along with my books, along with my vinyls, I just collect too much stuff. Like who even reads nowadays? Who listens to vinyls? Who watches movies on DVD? Not me, not me y'all. 
stay safe out there at seasons greetings this is honestly the best seasons greetings i've ever bought in of any artist ever it comes with so much that i still haven't even fully used everything i was kind of using the calendar but girl i suck at calendar this is a cute daikon literally a pc like holder it's the cutest thing ever i love it i'm gonna keep this oh this is the cd that that person made of child it's really cute. I think this is one of the BTS albums I'm gonna keep because I do really like the inclusion and how it looks. Actually, yeah, actually, I'm gonna give it away. I'm sorry. The Love Dive albums are really cute. I'm gonna keep these as well. Baekhyun, I will always buy Baekhyun albums, so I'm gonna keep those. Oh, hell freaking yeah. This is literally his best. Like, whoever designed the albums. Oh my gosh. I could give you a kiss. The room is looking a lot worse now. Okay, now I'm gonna do these top ones and then I still have the bottom ones, but for the bottom ones, I mostly used it for storage. I've just been stuffing a lot of stuff in here that literally do not need to be here. I collect all the confetti from concerts. I don't even know where this is from. I think this is NCT Dream. And I need to like categorize it and like display them in like a really cute way, but I just haven't. What the hell? I remember last year I started like a five minute journal. I never did it. I think I'm gonna keep the BTSB one. I really do like this one. And these are the Love Yourself. These hit different though. Like, I think I'm actually gonna keep the pink one because it's a little like washed out from the sun this is just like a very fun era and like a fun moment in my life like buying these it's just a very specific time in my life when i was like oh my gosh sell these and then i'm gonna keep the pink and the white one because these are a little bit more damaged these are still pretty good condition and if i change my mind then i'll change my mind I had bought these from Super M, which are like the little like pictures of them. I got Marks, Beckyons, and Taemins. I think I'm gonna keep these. These are like such an era. It's like vintage merch, you know, cause they're like not doing anything. Oh my God. There's so many things in here that I'm like, I forgot I had this. I have duplicates of this one because it's like signed. So I got this one that's signed from P1 Harmony. So the pink and the yellow. Oh, this one's signed by all the members. I'm gonna keep the signed ones and then sell the non-signed ones. Ghost 9, signed, hell yeah. Oh, what the hell? Two more in hyphen albums. <gasps> the baby. I cleaned out these four. I still have the bottom ones, but it's so messy here that I can't even move. So I'm gonna start storing them in there and just trying to make something cute like trying to fit ooh, as much as i can i did get two more shelves that i still am waiting for i got one of them but i think for that one i'm mostly gonna display my vinyls because i did accumulate a good amount of vinyls and i've been using my record player a lot more recently so i need like a good place for that i might fit a few albums there like some of the cute ones like beckyun and then i got another shelf that i don't know if i'm gonna put books in it oh my gosh i also got a wall shelf oh this is crazy okay i'm gonna try and come up 
up with something really cute to like display here and i have to dust off all the albums because they're all super dusty i think i got rid of a good amount of albums though like i'm kind of proud of myself i honestly thought i was only gonna get rid of like a few I don't know if I'm gonna do it by group. My room is very colorful. I wanna display more of the color out here. So all the greens, all the reds, all the pinks and blues, I'm gonna prioritize to be in the front. Okay, I'm gonna do a little time lapse. So enjoy this while I watch some YouTube or a movie. I forgot about this box that has way more albums in here i was like literally almost done and i was like wait that's like actually pretty good like i don't have a lot girl what is this no wonder i was like where's fact check golden age <gasps> my other deal because i was like where's my new at's albums girl they're in here oh my gosh there's my rise okay i'm kind of glad i found those because no offense okay but the albums that i still need to be put away like they don't have the prettiest of covers they're just not matching the cube color scheme that i want but the ones from here are actually pretty cute like these two are pretty 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 colors so i'm kind of glad about that because that means i can do a cute color palette on this last cube and then i'm gonna go through the bottom cubes because i still have to do those but i think we're off to a good middle ground this room is looking atrocious i'm watching open season because those are my comfort movies which i just realized they're very fun movies okay let's get to putting stuff away now it's hot i'm gonna empty out these two down here i got these for my old job this is just to cover like the mess that's down there but they're just these like plastic so here's where i have a lot of duplicates of albums that i again do not need Do you guys see that? Oh, this is ridiculous. Oh my god. Oh my god, all those freaking kinos. Y'all, I thought I was free. I thought I made it. I did not. Okay, I bought so many of the Super 1. I'm the one. Better run. Then you're done, done, done. Okay, it's the next day. I pretty much finished. I got a little bit overwhelmed because 
my room is still messy and there's just a lot of things I needed to do to fully have it clean and just the whole mess is bugging me. I really like how each cube looks like. I'm gonna add things to it and like make it cuter, add little plants or little cameras. But I did get rid of a good amount of stuff. So like this box over here is filled with albums. Also this box, a few posters and albums and stuff. Stored my CDs, like the digipacks and all of the jewel case CDs in another container that I plan on putting on another drawer and the drawer actually just came right now this is pretty much how my shelf looks like right now and i'm pretty happy with it i like how it turned out it looks very clean very neat and this is usually the area where i film like my outfit videos if i'm filming tiktoks or reels or like showing my outfit it's usually in this general area so it's nice that it's gonna be more organized right now i haven't touched this last cube over here because this is where i keep all of the big seasons greetings and also a box filled with stickers <laughs> Okay, so this is the first cube. I think this one is probably one of my favorites. I wanted to stick to this white and pinkish, silverish theme to it. I knew for sure I wanted to display the perfume albums. So I did a Jungwoo's perfume box and then the other perfume in the back. And then I also put RM's Indigo little mini album here. Sparkling water with this fake plant and then i put a little lego penguin it's so cute and then my mini digital camera and then i put a few pink ones such as nct dreams and 127 cherry bomb and then a few silver superhuman exo and i don't know which one this one is all of the white albums are in the back over there there's more back there too sticking with white silver and pink colors and then i also put my bb is it BB? My BB glasses case that I thrifted as well that I think just like pulls everything together like the little gold in the font matches the gold in the Jungwoo and the gold in that flower and then the black brings out all the black colors in the fonts and stuff. I've been really loving silver recently or grays, silvers and grays and this like chrome kind of reflective color just because it reflects any color that's in front of it. So I knew I wanted to do that kind of theme in this first one just to make it look a little cleaner at the top. But yeah, I'd say this one is definitely one of my favorites. I love how I did it. Since I got the perfume albums, I knew I wanted to display them in one way or another. It looks cute and the little pop of green. It's just too good. It's too good. This one is the second cube. This one I stuck to pink, white, and green. Here I put my recent 80s albums, the pink and the blue one. I displayed the wavy on my youth one in the front because I really like how it looks. It looks like a diary. And then I did a fake plant. I did more NCT albums. Here's my BTS pink one. It's super faded. And then Tame In. And then I displayed the Itzy Checkmate in the back because I like the pink font and it matches with this other pink. And pink and green is my favorite color combination. So I knew I wanted to have a cube with that color combo. I also use bookends to make sure they stand up straight. You could buy these at Staples, any store that sells like notebooks or like Target or something. But yeah, this one is really cute. I love it so much and I love how both of these look. Like there's hints of green, there's hints of pink, there's hints of white. Like it just looks so good. This one is also really, really cute. I love the colors on here. I displayed the Love Dive by Ive albums and then Shalala and then Bambi. In the back, I displayed the boys and then NCT 127 and NCT Universe. And I really like how the yellow font of Bambi matches like the yellow of Shalala and also like a hint of the yellow from Love Dive. I always think that pink and green look really good together. So I knew I wanted to put these two together. The albums I displayed in the back were all the P1 Harmony albums and don't get me wrong, I love those albums but visually it's just black. I try not to display a lot of black because the colors in my room is like bright colors but if the p1 harmony albums had covers that were like bright colors i would totally display them it's just their aesthetic and their whole concept of their albums has like a more darker theme to it which is fine but like that's just not my kind of aesthetic like, i think the neo zone albums are back there and then most of the p1 harmony ones and then a few ive as well but this one is the third one i think it's really cute i'm definitely gonna add like a few things floating on here and maybe 
over here like a little plant or something because it does look a little bland compared to these other ones i'm for sure gonna add something i just don't know what maybe like a little plushy or something i think that would be cute and then this last one i was struggling a lot especially in the end there i was working with like my last few albums that i needed to organize and i used most of my prettier looking ones over here so i was kind of left with like the big skinny ones and then like some that just are not my vibe wanted to go for this like black and white theme so that one is dio's album but i flipped it backwards because i preferred this cover more than the front but i like this one because it's like him on the grass all of the big paper size albums i displayed over there so there's like a lot of colors over there displayed the les seraphim i like the green border so i knew i wanted it to be there for like a hint of color i displayed the nct dream candy tin case and then i put a little the little egg plushy jelly cat plushy but i think i'm gonna remove it because i don't really like it i'm gonna put another plushy there but i just put it for right now because I don't know where else to put it uh but yeah i'm definitely gonna add something that matches a little bit more of the color palette over here and then here's the other dio album maverick and then a few twice these were the last two and these i cover with this yellow plastic like i showed you guys before just to like hide the junk because this is mostly just for storage not really for like display there's a lot back there but majority of the rest of the albums that i have that i couldn't really like have a theme for so i have a few ats a few twice nct there's a lot of nct back there super m and also ghost nine so this is just mostly for storage and then i just put this over it you can see the mess but it's not that bad and then over here as i mentioned i keep all my seasons greetings so i have eight teases i have a wavy box p1 harmony and nct 127 and here i keep all of my cds that i need to go through because this is literally so full and then like a crochet kit and like a few other boxes this is a box where i keep all my stickers that i need to go through but i just haven't yet and i'm just gonna leave it like that for now we're not gonna talk about it but yeah and that's how this whole shelf looks i really like how it looks i showed my mom and she really liked it and she thinks it also makes the room look a lot more cleaner and a lot more organized because there's not a bunch of stuff just like packing up because if you see this compared to how it was before like before oh my god literally i couldn't even sneak anything in there because it was so so full and then over here i still need to work on this because i'm gonna fix this whole section here are my vinyls my record player but i'm not counting that because it's not part of my album decorating thing but i love this whole shelf this is my favorite part of the room i would say <laughs> Let me know which cube is your favorite. I think my favorite one is between these two. I really like the whole perfume section over here from Doje Jung. And then I also really like the color palettes here, like the pinks and the green. And then I was having a little bit trouble with this one. As you guys saw, I tried displaying my CDs there, but I didn't really like the concept. I'm pretty proud of myself for getting rid of the amount of albums that I did. I didn't think I was, and I didn't think I was gonna get rid of any NCT, but I did realize I had accumulated a bunch of copies of like the same version and i'm just trying to reduce my collection and i know nct is going to be coming out with like hella versions and hella albums like dream and wavy and 127 and you from now on i'm just going to stick to just one copy per version because it's just going to accumulate and accumulate and i'm already super overwhelmed so if you liked any of the albums definitely go check out my depop i don't know if i'm going to open a trading account because i feel like that's a lot easier and it'll get more exposure i am going to clean out my pc books and for some of the albums Albums, I am gonna sell them with the PC that I got them with so like for in hyphen the boys TXT stray kids just because I don't really stand those groups as much anymore and I'm just gonna sell it with the album I'm either gonna do that on Depop or Instagram I don't know which is better but if they don't sell midway through this year i'm just gonna give them away there's like a bin at sarang hello where you can drop off all the albums that you don't want anymore and people just pick them up for like scrapbooking so i'm just gonna do that because i'm i'm trying to get rid of everything that i have for selling all of this is stuff that i'm gonna sell like all my clothes and i don't want to keep that for the rest of the year just waiting for people to buy it and i'm also not gonna be selling it for super expensive everything is most likely gonna be under ten dollars and for some i'm gonna be like you could just have it just 
just pay for the shipping like that's literally it i think that's everything for this unbox for the unboxing i hope you guys enjoyed this video it was very much needed and i'm very happy with my progress so far but this isn't it for my room decoration this is just one little episode of this whole process so don't forget to check out the next video where i'm gonna be putting up my new shelves such as this big one that literally just came in this is where i'm gonna put the cds and other books and plants and stuff because i realized i needed more like surface area to put all of my knickknacks i'm setting up two shelves and then one wall shelf that i'm pretty excited about don't forget to check out those videos in the future i'm excited to show you guys how this looks the whole room transformation look don't forget to check me out on depop that's where i'm going to be selling most of my clothes and maybe some albums on there i also want to display these so bad these are so cute anyways thank you guys so much for watching i am gonna turn off the camera and start filming for the next video so if i'm wearing the same thing you know why don't forget to follow me on my social media instagram tiktok and pinterest and depop thank you guys so much for watching and i will see you guys in my next video which hopefully is my decorating video let's go mm -hmm.